One important thing to keep in mind as you're evaluating blockchain is it's like hot sauce. And I want to give credit where credit's due for this analogy. This was inspired by a friend of mine, Samson Williams, a thought leader in the blockchain space. But Samson loves to talk about blockchain being a lot like hot sauce. Hot sauce is surprising because you can put it on a number of things and it really tastes good. But there are some things hot sauce just doesn't belong on. You'd never put hot sauce on ice cream. Understand that blockchain is like hot sauce. There are a lot of areas you can add a little splash of blockchain to and end up making a much better and more compelling solution. But there are some areas that you can't add blockchain to without making things a lot worse. And just like hot sauce, there's a big misconception that blockchain is an all or nothing proposition. That if we're going to architect and develop a solution on blockchain, we either have to build something that exists entirely on blockchain, or we need to build something that exists entirely on conventional technology. The truth is that like hot sauce, blockchain is really best when it's combined with something. If you were hungry and poured yourself a big bowl of hot sauce, not only would you be unsatisfied and unhappy, um, but you wouldn't want to repeat the process again. And it's the same way with blockchain. If you're looking at building a solution completely and entirely on the blockchain without exploring some of the amazing potential that you get by combining blockchain with conventional technology, then you probably got a bad recipe. So when you're thinking about blockchain and how to add it into your personal or professional life, understand that it's not a meal all by itself. It's just a little splash of hot sauce you put on something that already works pretty well.